Hey, how's it going? Thanks for tuning in. So this week, I'm gonna be showing you guys how to get these cool car mounted shots. All right, so the device I'll be using today is a Delkin device, Fat Gecko dual suction mount. And you're able to use this thing uh, in multiple ways at different angles and different lengths and uh, adjustments. What you wanna do is just, you know, it, it does help to plan, trust me. I know I'm a, uh, I do like to do a lot of random things and I like to be sporadic and stuff. But when it comes to shooting, I do like to plan my shots up. Sometimes I over plan, but I do have to say, okay, I wanna get a, you know, outside car view, I wanna get the rear, or I wanna get mid rear or passenger window or passenger side, something like that. All right, so once you have your shots planned out, go ahead and mount that bad boy right into your car. Notice how mine is a gloss finish. It helps a lot with the suction. Make sure that baby's on there pretty good. You know, you want it nice and snug. Blow on that sucker, and if it's not falling off, then hey, you're good to go, why not? So once you have the camera mounted properly on your desired location of the vehicle, you definitely want to get the shot in frame and in focus. It helps to have a friend or family member or your girlfriend to go ahead and pose so you can rack focus properly to where you want the shots to be connected. Now moving on to the interior, uh, this is how you could set up the interior shot to that passenger uh, front side view that's very useful that I like to use. Uh, with this, you can see how um, versatile that the fat gecko mount is. You got the dual suction cups and you're able to you know, adjust the, the, the top of it at a ball joint and then you're also able to adjust the base plate of it ball joint as well, which this is really cool because you can see how sturdy and uh, dynamic you can make these views and change these angles. Um, there's so many ways, and this is the greatest part about it. You can go left, you can go right, you can bring it back more forward, closer or further to the subject at a different angle, tilt, and stuff like that. So it's very great. You get to see how sturdy it is. Uh, you can see just by hitting it, it's le very little vibration. All the mounts are rubberized, and it's very quiet actually, so it works very well, even without like a stabilizer or something. So I hope you enjoyed it. Like I said, if you have any comments or questions, feel free to leave them below and um, like or subscribe and share with any friends or family that, think, that you think they could use this uh, for maybe a business, a company, a ministry, or a nonprofit organization. If you want to change it up a little bit in your, in your cinema or just in media all around, it's really cool. You know, A lot of car talks or conversations are really fun and more engaging and it's something different than an office or a background. And trust me, I like doing those too, but you definitely always want to look and, and I guess you say think outside the box and, and change it up to something different. So hope you guys like this. I hope you like this and um, you know, just stay tuned for more.